Okay, hi. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll start with demonstration of the anatomy of the G junction. So what I'm going to show you is now I'm at the lower end of the esophagus and the first important structure to identify is the aorta, okay? So as you talk the scope 180 degrees, what you find this long tubular structure is the aorta, all right? I push the scope, move it back and forth gently with my big wheel towards me. I'll show you with the Doppler, this is the pulsatile sensations of the aorta and I push the scope down and I push the scope down. What you have to identify is the celiac artery takeoff, okay? So here the celiac artery is coming right there. So as I talk the scope, it's coming slightly on the right of the screen. That's the celiac artery takeoff. And the crura of the diaphragm just over here, okay? So now that's an important structure to identify. And as I see the celiac artery takeoff, then the next thing to do is to use your big wheel away from you. Can you show me the big wheel away from you? Can you show the big wheel away? Okay, so I'm doing the big wheel away. And what you see on the screen is the pancreas, right? So this is the salt and pepper appearance of the pancreas right there. And while when you reach this point, you push the scope a little further and you push it further. And what you have to do is gentle clockwise motion, okay? Can you show how I'm doing the gentle clockwise motion here? So while we are here in the counterclockwise, you see the neck of pancreas first. This is the neck of pancreas. And uh, you'll see the portal confluence just below it. So this is the confluence, okay? So splenic vein, superior mesenteric vein forming the portal vein, okay? And then I'm going to do clockwise torque here, slow and steady, clockwise torque, clockwise torque. And follow this, this is the pancreas, and you're going to follow the pancreas. You're going to follow the pancreas, and I have my big wheel towards me with suction. And I'm going to do clockwise torque, clockwise torque, clockwise torque. And what you have now reached, now you've reached the tail of pancreas, because now you see the kidney here. This is the left kidney. This salt and pepper structure is the pancreas. And then I do more clockwise torque, more clockwise torque. And I'm going to pull my scope back a, a tad bit. And now what you start seeing on the screen here is the spleen, pancreas, tail, and kidney, all right? So you do more clockwise torque, and now you have reached the spleen and the tail of pancreas, right there. And what's important is to keep doing this counterclockwise and clockwise. So now what you are able to see is the entire pancreas from the neck, body, and tail region. And it's also important to go a little back and forth because you want to see the pancreas in all the planes. And right, there you go. So, yeah. And, and the more other important, the structure to be identified in the pancreas is the pancreatic duct. And I'll show you with Doppler where the duct is. I'm going to do clockwise start. So this is a regular patient with a non-dilated pancreatic duct. It can get slightly difficult to identify if it's really non-dilated, but this is the pancreatic duct here. This structure here it has slight hyperechoic margins, but that's the pancreatic duct. And as I do gentle clockwise motion, I have to follow it as best as I can in the body tail region. So it's non-dilated in this particular case. All right. All right. So again, counterclockwise and then clockwise all the way down to the pancreas, kidney, tail, spleen, all right? Now, when you are at the kidney, the other important structure to identify is the adrenal gland, okay? Remove the flow. So just pull back a little bit and then you can do a slight motion. So let me show you. When you are at the kidney, between the kidney and the spleen, there is the adrenal gland. And I'm, what I'm going to do is at, at the kidney, I'm going to do a slight counterclockwise motion with big wheel towards me. And what you see on the screen, the structure here, this one right here, actually let me use this. This is the adrenal gland, okay? So this is the adrenal gland. It's a seagull shaped structure right there. So now I'm getting nice views of the adrenal gland, okay? All right, so that's one. 